every yard I get with Lamar Jackson is plus one to any stat. But we're starting at a zero overall. So yards are not so easy to come by. That's that's a pick. Our goal is to get him to a 99 overall in just five games, beating our current record of six games with Patrick Mahomes from our last video. Well, we've got to be able to hit short passes to start because Lamar does not have the throw power or the accuracy. Perfect accuracy on the first throw, though. We'll actually take that one. But it didn't take long for our accuracy to fall apart. That's a pick. Oh my god, already, dude, on our second throw, we're throwing interceptions. We have had the guy wide open and Lamar just sailed that ball. Our goal in the first game is just get as many yards as possible. It's going to be tough to win, but we'll do our best. Trying to find Devin Duvernay here and Lamar overthrows him and that's another interception. And so we know it's going to be nearly impossible to win this game. So we try to hit some slip screens, some really short passes until we connect on a really nice pass down the field. Can I just, can I get it there, please? Aggressive catch. Third and eight. Can Mark Andrews be great? He can! We got the first. Let's go. And it was at this point that I realized how effective of a target Mark Andrews is going to be for us. And I started hitting him on drag routes as often as possible until our bad accuracies come back to bite us yet again. So we settle for the field goal and try to make it a one possession game, please. Great throw. Poor accuracy, but we caught it anyways. We can get this within. Oh my gosh. Yes, yes. Yes, go Dobbins, go Dobbins, go Dobbins. Time out. We're just going to take our field goal, make it a one-score game. I believe we get ball back after half, so I'll take that. But even after moving the ball down the field really well, our accuracy still come back to bite us. We have to upgrade these stats. Oh my God, please. Yes, yes, and a block, and a block. That's a big play. 239 passing yards right now. Oh my God, how did he get that through? Please get in the end zone. And after I've been connecting with my running back on this Texas route super well, Lamar makes a big mistake. No, oh, we fumbled. That might be our chance to win the game that we just gave up. The Jets end up scoring. It's a six-point game. It's not over until it is. And we're throwing picks. Oh, my God, man. But it's not a total loss because we ended up with 293 passing yards with Lamar Jackson plus our three rushing yards, meaning we get 296 upgrade points to spend on his stats. I think that's our best first game yet. With 296 points, we're putting our first 99 on short throw accuracy, our second 99 on medium throw accuracy, and our remaining 98 on throw power. We'll get our deep throw accuracy up next. And after just our first game, he's already a 27 overall, but we only have four games left to do this. And now that we've got our legs under us, let's make things just a little more difficult. From here on out, we only get one upgrade point for every two passing yards, but rushing yards will still be one-to-one. -one. Though his speed rating is still a zero, so I don't think we'll be running the ball anytime soon. And with a lot of pressure on game two, since we only have five games to complete this challenge, this game can best be defined as an absolute tease. Every time it felt like something was going right, something would go absolutely wrong. Oh, and we overthrew it. We probably had a 99-yard touchdown there. But then we went right back to it. Catch that. He does. Go, 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 Bateman. 99-yard touchdown on the corner route. We're into the end zone. But like I said, one thing goes right, and then another thing goes wrong. And he didn't even animate for the ball. He literally did not even try to go. And we can't make a tackle. You've got to be joking me, man. Things were going too well. And this is what happened. So we missed some more wide open passes, which would have likely resulted in a touchdown and then end up settling for the field goal. Let's we'll see if our defense can make a stop before halftime. Yes, Mark Andrews, who we have not hit at all yet. 289 yards with four left in the third. They end up taking a three point lead. And when we need Lamar the most, he sells. Bateman's open and Lamar can't hit him. It's just inaccurate for no reason. But on fourth and 16 with the game on the line, he redeems himself. Catch it. We do. Just for him to sell again. Oh my God, bro. I throw a pick. Are you serious? We've got one last try at a money drive after our defense makes a stop. Because if we win this game, we get an extra 50 points to upgrade Lamar's stats. Thank you. Mark Andrews on the run. Great pass from Lamar. Perfect accuracy. And on a big fourth and 10, our final chance. We need someone to come up clutch. I need Lamar to nope. throw an accurate pass, and he can't. And we might have just lost the game because of that. But we ended up with 392 passing yards and a 2 to 1 ratio. That's 196 upgrade points. Points. We'll take it, man. I'm spending 99 on his deep throw accuracy. So hopefully we don't get screwed on those passes that are wide open again. One to finish off throwing power. And with our 96 points that are left, let's throw him on speed because we get a one-to-one -one ratio for rushing yards still. And he's up to a 51 overall. So that was a fairly large jump. But with only three games left, we have a lot of work left to do. And if I'm unable to complete this challenge within the five games allotted, I'm going to be buying a Lamar Jackson jersey and giving it away to someone in the comments down below. We've got no time to waste. Only three games left, and we're playing the Patriots. 
And hopefully we finally have the stats that will enable Lamar to be accurate with his passes. And I gotta say, this one was entirely on me. That's a pick that I did not see that guy at all. They end up scoring three and then I do it again. Oh my God, I thought that was a touchdown. Please catch it, thank you. Good, good, go. I just, ah, I need every yard I can get. 77 yards in the first quarter is not going to cut it. So we continue to drive down the field, making a few nice passes until finally we're able to QB sneak it into the end zone, taking a 7-6 to six lead. And right when I think things are going super well, Lamar starts selling on us. Oh my God, that was a touchdown, dude. On back-to-back -back throws. But on a big fourth and 10, Mark Andrews comes up clutch. Andrews just has to make a play. He does, thank God. But... I'm an idiot. I threw a pick again. Thank God our defense continues to come up clutch and keep us in this game. We've got one more opportunity to score before half. Give us the lead before the half after the defense went big. And he does. One step closer to an extra 50 points. And in the second half, everything finally starts to come together and we go to a bomb. Please get there. Touchdown. Touchdown. What a dot from Lamar. The throwing stats are finally paying off. And we got it. X wide open over the middle. Make a man get miss. Off me. Finally, we make someone miss. We break some tackles. Let's go. Yes, Duvernay wide open. Please get there. Get there. Go, go, go. Touchdown! What a huge score for us as we take a 28 to 16 lead. We got the ball back on the nine yard line and after a few Aaron passes, Lamar comes up clutch. Touchdown! Let's go, man! At this rate, it's fourth and 10. I probably shouldn't be going for this, but I'm going to because we just want the passing yards. We can get more. Mark Andrews, just like that, buries himself into the end zone. Ah, another rushing yard for probably another touchdown here. We should start rewarding ourselves for touchdowns, man. Especially as these challenges get shorter and more difficult. We ended up with 499 passing yards and four rushing yards with Lamar, which gives us 253 upgrade points. Oh, I needed that game. That was a big one for us. We're going to finish off speed, getting us to 99. We're going to put 99 into acceleration so we can start racking up some rushing yards with Lamar. And I'm getting killed throwing under pressure. So we're getting this one to 99 as well to hopefully avoid any other inaccurate balls. And you guys have been killing me in the comments in the last couple videos. We'll put our remaining 52 points into awareness to see how much that affects his overall rating. Plus, we have our 50 points from our win from that game, our bonus. That's going to get us up to the 99. And we'll put our remaining three into agility. That's going to put our overall rating up to a 95 overall. We are so close. Awareness is absolutely massive, like you guys have been telling me. But our work is not done yet. We only have two games left to do this. And now we're switching the difficulty to all Madden. So this is going to get way, way tougher for us. Bill's defense is good. So this is not going to be an easy game, especially on all Madden. It gets really difficult out here. We're just going to hit X out of the backfield. That's our favorite play so far. But on fourth and one, we saw why all men is actually so difficult. Well, linebacker's able to swat that out. Now Lamar's throwing under pressure inaccurates despite having a 99 rating. I want to put the ball in Lamar's hands because he's just... No, I mean, and we fumble. Our carrying rating is so bad. And on a big fourth down. Look at that, dude. I mean, what am I supposed to do, man? But our defense comes up big, and we've got another opportunity. Oh, my God. Touchdown. Touchdown. Mark Andrews catches it in stride. And right after driving down the field, things were starting to go well all of a sudden. And we throw a pick. Oh, my God. All Madden is just so tough, dude. So we go down 13 nothing, but I'm not ready to quit yet. We still have time in the first half to make a score. We break a tackle. He does. He's just a beast. He's carrying him on his back. And when we need it at the most, Lamar steps up. Touchdown! Great pass! Great catch! Unfortunately, our defense caved. They go up 20 to 7, and we want to try to get another score before the end of the first half because we get ball back. Oh my god, what a beautiful pass. Oh my god, what a beautiful pass. It's so crucial that we get the win in this game. Another one. I mean, this play is just working so well for us. I can't go away from it. So we finally go to Lamar's legs, his biggest strength. Lamar breaks the tackle. Oh my god, slide down. Let's go. We'll, we'll take the rushing yards. I can please scramble in. Please, no, 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 no. Spike the ball, 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 spike the ball. Okay, we're gonna go for the touchdown and hopefully Mark Andrews can get open. And he does. Please get in there. Touchdown! As time expires in the half, we made it a one possession game. We found a play that's working super well against the defense that the Bills are running. So I ran it a couple times in a row and Lamar puts every throw on the money. Holy crap, Lamar. And after taking a one point lead, now our mission is simple. Maintain that lead and rack up as many yards as possible. 358 passing yards, dude. They off Lamar. You got speed. We're going to slide down. And just when things are starting to go a little too well, nope. we run into some issues. Some of this is on me and, and we throw a pick. Oh, we 
throw a pick. At this point, we're just hopeful that our defense can make a stop. Holy crap. The boys made a stop, but we're still seeing drop issues. Catch the ball, dude. Even on one of the craziest plays Lamar has <laughs> had yet. Oh my God, Lamar. Oh my God. No, catch the ball, bro. We're able to convert on a big third down, drive down the field and get in the end zone, taking an eight point lead just for our defense to make another stop. And after driving down the field yet again, we settle for three to go up by two possessions. Perfectly timed kick. That one's going to go through, and we'll take a two-possession lead on our way to an extra 50 points. At this point, it was about time I took advantage of Lamar's speed and acceleration. We started using his legs, and boy, did it pay off. Great blocks. We're going to slide down. More rushing yards for us. Take off. Slide. Don't fumble. Thank you. Get in there, Lamar. Let's go, baby. What a freaking game for the Baltimore Ravens. And what a game for Lamar Jackson. We ended with 500 passing yards, which is 250 points, plus the 58 from our rushing yards, plus the 50 points for the win. We have 358 upgrade points to spend. Oh, I'm feeling good about completing this challenge within the five games. Let's put 99 on throw on the run, since that's definitely a quarterback stat. Let's put 99 on break sacks, since that's definitely a quarterback stat. Let's finish off agility with another 96. And then let's put 64 of our remaining points on play action. And I wonder what his overall is going to be at this point. I honestly have no idea. Lamar is up to a 99 overall. We did it in just four games. And if you enjoyed this one, you're going to love me doing it with Patrick Mahomes. That one was super tough.